Mr. Krupp or we'll hypnotize you. <laughs> Start Hold on to your capes. Captain Underpants, the first epic movie has just hit the small screen. Here to tell us all about how the Captain Underpants concept came to be is children's author and illustrator Dave Pilkey, hero to households everywhere. Oh, thank you. Thank you. So good to thank see you. you. Thank you. Let's start with this. You're not reading that wrong. It's Dave without the E. Could we talk about how that happened? Yes. Uh, when I was uh, about 18 years old, I worked at a Pizza Hut, and they were making a name tag for me. Remember those those little label makers that had the red tape? Yeah. And you, went, and, and you punched out the letters? My dad has one of those. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, in the one that they had at this Pizza Hut, the letter E was broken, so when they punched out my name it just said DAV and it stuck it stuck okay yeah. so let's talk about the fact that this started you know in grade two that's right for you. Yes, yes and it came from something where now thank goodness we're learning more and more about it but at the time people didn't know what to do with little Dave Pilkey because you seem to be acting up in class turns yes. out it's because I had ADHD um, actually it was before they even had a term for it they called it a, they called it extreme hyperactivity when I was a kid but my teacher didn't have the resources. She didn't know what to do with me, so she would send me out into the hallway. Yeah. So it was ADHD and dyslexia. And dyslexia. And to think here you yes. are a best-selling author. My gosh. So you started daydreaming as you would, mm -hmm. and you came up with Captain Underpants. <laughs> yeah. And when she read what you were working on, she wasn't having that either. She was not real happy about the underpants thing. <laughs> yeah. Uh, actually, the funny thing is she gave me the idea, though. Yeah. We, she was talking in class one day, and she said the word underwear, and everybody in the whole class started <laughs> laughing. And I thought, wow, underwear makes everybody laugh. I should, I should do something with that. So, so yeah, that's where, where it came from. Well, I told you as a kid, I was obsessed with Amelia Bedelia because it was sort oh. of that little bit of rebellion where you giggle, mm -hmm. and I shouldn't be reading this, but I know I'm allowed because it's written for, you know, my age. And this is what you've been able to bring. I know my nephews are just absolutely consumed. They're, they laugh out loud, and it brings back that love of reading. So how important is that to you to have kids truly love reading your work? Well, I, you know, reading is the most important thing. It really changed my, my life. Um, when I was a kid, especially having dyslexia, being the only kid in the class who couldn't read as well as everyone else, it, it was kind of an isolating thing. Mm -hmm. So I practiced a lot. My mom took me to the library. She let me pick out my own books, which was incredibly important. And I read for fun, and that's what turned me into a reader. And so. My job now is to make fun books that turn other kids into readers. Including Dogman. This yes. is your third installment of Dogman. It was only released a couple of weeks ago, already on the bestsellers list. Thank and of course, yes. we're just taking a look at um, the, the film version of Captain Underpants. That is actually in stores now. It was released yesterday. yesterday but it's right. been years in the making. That's true, yeah. Uh, I think about six or seven years ago is when we signed all the contracts and they started working on it. And it just came out this summer. It got amazing reviews, and uh, I'm so excited to have it on home video now. Our, our DVD, actually, I'm still saying video. Like, Same. Like VHS. VHS, yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, totally. Yeah. Did you meet Kevin Hart? I did. I met the entire cast. It was so nice. Everyone was, was wonderful, and they're all amazing writers as well as performers and comedians, and so they added a lot of their, themselves to the characters, which was really nice. And how many books total have you written now? I've written uh, 63 books. Oh my gosh. And there have been 12 Captain Underpants books. Take that, all you naysayers, That's right. right? Yeah, yeah. You really are such a creative literary genius, and oh, you bring I, I so much love that. to reading. You do. You bring joy, so it doesn't feel like a task. It's actually joy for families and kids thank to you, read your work thank and to watch this movie. So thank you so much. A pleasure to meet you, Dean. So nice to meet you, Dean. Come back anytime. Thanks, Dean. For more information, breakfasttelevision.ca.